I got want to continue our reveal of our ice shaver here and, and give you a little background about why we have it and why we bought it. Uh, in order to do that, I need to tell you a, a little story about the Philippines. And in the Philippines, there's a favorite dessert of Filipinos called halo halo. And in English, halo halo means mix mix. It's especially good on hot days, and in the Philippines, that's most days. You can find little Lipa huts all along the roadsides, some of them end to end, fine for your business. <laughs> Sometimes it'll go on for maybe a quarter mile, you know. Uh, trying to get you to come into their one particular little little Nipa hut, which is just a little house made of bamboo. I'll have to post a picture for you so it helps you for those non-Filipinos that might be watching this. Halo Halo is an icy dessert made up of shave ice and various other ingredients. And I'm not going to get into those other ingredients right now. Probably at the end of this I'll, I'll share that with you. So Halo Halo soon became my family's favorite, and we always had to stop and buy some anytime we went anywhere. Uh, back in the USA though, we would try to find places where we could buy our, our favorite dessert, only to be disappointed either by the small cup size or the high price, which was usually five or six dollars each. It wasn't long before we found we could make our own, but the little handheld shaver about this bag and you had to shave across the ice. It just wasn't worth it and it just took too long. Uh, recently on a trip to Seafood City we saw a little food place and, and in their food court uh, they had this little ice machine that I saw and I just thought it was just the greatest thing I've ever seen. And we have been spending so much money on, on, on Holo Holo I was like you know let's buy one. So Next thing I knew, my wife was buying one and it showed up, uh, as you saw in the previous video, uh, at our door and uh, here it is. So let's get into it. I, I want to show you how it works, okay? And let's get rid of my face and bring you in closer <laughs> to see the machine. And let's get started taking a look at this again. I've got some ice here. Up on top is your hopper. We're going to pour our ice into the hopper, like that. Close the lid. Now let's go over some of the features here. We have our on, off, and reverse. Why it does have a reverse, I don't know. Maybe sometimes it gets stuck. I've never had it happen. It's a very powerful machine. Over here we have an adjustment for rough and fine. I've set it to where I like it, uh, more of on, on the fine side for when I'm making hollow hollow. Right here is our chute where the ice comes out. Down here is our drain. It catches anything that doesn't make it into your cup or bowl. And down below here is your drain plug. So when you're done and you're going to clean the machine and anything left inside here either melts or drops down. It goes down into here and is held until you're ready to empty this here. There is a grate that's removable. I usually find it easier just to take a, a towel and, and put in there and soak up the water rather than remove the plug and, and risk uh, losing the little silicone plug or what have you. It's usually not that much water in there unless you leave a lot in the hopper. Okay. I will tell you that it is a powerful motor and it is quite loud, but you be the judge. So let's make some and let's see what we get. Keep your finger on the trigger because otherwise you might be surprised at how quick it shaves the ice and you'll be trying to turn it off and before you know it you'll have shave ice all over the place. Here we go. go. A whole nice bowl of shave ice ready to make some nice hollow hollow or or maybe even your favorite Hawaiian ice drink like they have in Hawaii with the different uh, oh, flavors of, of 
of juice or something that they pour over it. We used to get that all the time too when I lived in Hawaii. But beautiful, beautiful. Rather than waste this, I'm not ready to make holo holo. I think I'm going to be naughty and make a snowball out of it and <laughs> let you see what I'm going to do with it later. few inches later. Welcome. <clears throat> Welcome if you're still with me. I wanted to get back to everybody and uh, no, I don't like that. A few moments later. <clears throat> Eventually. Okay. Okay, we're going to continue with our reveal of our ice machine, our ice shaver. It wasn't long before we found we could make our own. Okay, so now we're going to start over. Ah, sounds like I'm reading it. And I am. Meanwhile. One eternity later. Uh. Okay, I want to continue our reveal of our ice shaver here and, and give you a little background about why we have it and why we bought it. 